So Kusak is coming out on global. Um, from when I put this video up, it'll probably be, um, you know, in a few hours. So he's coming out for global. Now, people are going to probably skip, which is good, right? If you're skipping this banner, that's good. Um, you know, Kusak isn't really, he's not the craziest unit. He is good. He is good, but he's not, you know, like, ah, broken, you need him for this meta. Like, no, he's just good. Like, he's just a very good, um, you know, just usable character, right? So, if you're skipping this banner, um, you know, props to you. But I will say, I do think that Kusak has the better banner. Not by a whole lot, but I think literally just because Green Gulther is on here... I think that's why. I uh, I honestly do. I really do. Just because Green Gother. Now the banner is more or less the same. Um, you know the rates are the same. The the featured characters besides Kusak are the same. Like that's it. And then the unfeatured characters, they have changed a little bit. So instead of Chandler, Tarmiel, Sario, Bellion, and Alette, we have Oslo and Hulk, Deanne. Green Roxy, Red Shin, and Green Gother. So all of the Halloween units. And then we have the, uh, I don't know what you would call Deanne and like Oslo. Or not Deanne, but um, Deanne and Hawk and Oslo. I don't know what you would call them. Like celebratory units? I, I don't know. But yeah, so he has all of these like limited event characters, which is good. That's why I'm saying that his banner might like just a little bit a little bit be better than margaret's right just because of all these limited characters that aren't always on a banner but keep in mind do keep in mind go there shin and roxy halloween is literally um a little bit over a month away so keep that in mind so they will return they definitely will return um probably Maybe not exactly on Halloween, but maybe the 25th, 26th. So they should return with the next Halloween unit we get. If they don't, that's going to be some real BS. Like, no pun intended, but that's going to be some BS, man. If they don't return, instead they give us like Halloween, Meliodas, um, you know, Gila in a lane. I, that would be the biggest cuck. But I really feel like they're going to be back anyway. So if you don't want to summon now, you know, sure sure don't summon you know what i mean like that's not a bad thing that you're not summoning it's actually a good thing because what the collab characters i don't want to say they were leaked but we we're definitely gonna get characters we're definitely gonna get some um some collab characters soon i don't know when but we're definitely gonna get them pretty soon so keep that in mind now the units on here i would actually argue that they're not the craziest right at least the changed ones right they're not the craziest green gold they're obviously being the best but red shin you're not gonna use him uh you can use green roxy actually green roxy low key might be a viable option to fight against margaret because she can actually cancel stances so if tarmiel uses a stance she can cancel stances she has a charge skill she has a lot going for her man um green roxy is one of those units where i would just literally argue that um you know, she can low-key be a meta unit if they decide to come out with a unit that works well with her, like synergize it with her well. Because you have to use humans with her. That's the thing, right? So you have to use humans with her. So if they come out with, I don't know, like a, a Hauser, a Grandmaster Hauser, and he increases human basic stats by, um, you know, 20%, uh, that'd be good for her. That would be very, very good for her. So we'll see, right? But she can low-key with the right support just be one of the top tier units even to this day like even to this day so she is she's good um wedding deanne she's all right um she has a f like a few things going for her like she has blockade i believe that's what it is that she has um she has that i think she can what else does she have attack disable or something like that i haven't looked at this deanne a lot okay no so she disables ultimate moves and then yeah so she has blockage or blockade, whatever you want to call it, and then, um, you know, this which disables ultimate moves, which, I mean, I guess, but I don't think it matters because Margaret can cleanse, I don't think it matters because Margaret can cleanse, but she also has this very, very good passive for giants, if they make, you know, more giants she potentially might return to the you know to the game like in pvp if they make it to where giants are actually let's say they make a new droll they make a new matrona right and then you run her 
with them she's <laughs> low key i mean this is powerful man this is very very powerful so yeah she's not bad at all her ultimate is still you know very good it hits very um very hard at six out of six it's an aoe so it's not you know it's not gonna be weak by by any means it's gonna be pretty damn strong so yeah she's all right and then also in hulk um i i don't know um for the most part i would say they're all right but their whole thing like their whole gimmick revolves around them stealing ultimate move gauge orbs that's it right that's their whole entire gimmick and then the expulsion so their expel is very powerful but you need it to be six out of six for it to last for two turns and i i feel like uh <laughs> that's low-key asking for a lot um I, I do feel like that's low-key asking for a lot but um they can be all right like they can be useful they can be useful um they have pretty good stats right they have pretty decent stats i would say so yeah they can be all right they can be good but for the most part i think a lot of people are gonna summon for kusad if not just for him then for halloween gother i feel like halloween gother definitely is gonna make you know make you summon on this banner regardless if you hate the character or not i don't care if you hate kusak but you can't deny that this banner has very good limited units on it right it does um even if they're not good i, I would say out of all these units that are on um you know that are here i would argue that the worst probably would be i was gonna say green monspeed and red shin i feel like they they are or no blue fraudron blue fraudron and red shin might be the worst on this feature list and obviously the green mons be a third but in terms of the change units from margaret yeah shin is definitely the worst out of here um they, i didn't know that about that dm being a second um i think also on hawk being third and you know gother and roxy are obviously just very good very very good so that's the banner the banner itself again you have to go 900 to guarantee yourself kusak i don't think people should do that i think they should save or skip um whatever you want to do right save up your gems you get a free multi so maybe if you get lucky with the free multi and get kusak i mean congratulations right you got kusak you get a free dupe from the event page but that's it that's that's literally it i feel like otherwise um you definitely should skip this banner i, I do feel like this is a very skippable banner jp should be getting their next revealed uh you know hero in a couple of days so if you want to wait and see what's coming next you can do that and then from there on decide if you want to summon but overall i would say skip saving your gems would be much better than summoning on this banner in my in my opinion again if you don't have green gother sure go crazy right sure whatever but if you have green gother i have a one out of six He's worked pretty well for me. <laughs> I don't know. He's worked pretty damn good for me at one out of six. So, I mean, hey, chasing copies, go ahead. But, I don't know. For the most part, I feel like this is definitely a skippable banner. Kusak is, like I said, he's good. But he's not meta breaking or, you know, anything crazy of the sort. He's just a very good, um, you know, solid unit. Solid unit. But, uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. If you made it this far, go ahead and leave a like. And that's going to be the end. I will see you all later.